Welcome back. I want to thank Brad Hunkins for stopping by. Humboldt State tonight. Join now our sports personality this week, Jamie Hay, who is the sports editor for the Lumberjack, which of course is the school newspaper here. So, uh, Jamie, talk about working for the Lumberjack. Well, it's definitely interesting. Um, it's a lot of fun. I got into it last semester. Um, I was made sports editor right away. Um, we didn't have one last semester, so it was I kind of was rushed into it. Um, I didn't know what I was doing. I kind of still don't know what I'm doing. Um, but there's, it's really- We always fake it in meetings, so don't worry about <laughs> of that. Of course, Jane. of That's course. <laughs> but um, I'm taking some classes and I'm learning and just the experience within itself is, is incredible. There's a, lot of, there's a lot of cool people on there also. Now, sports, you're the sports editor. That's a pretty much male dominated profession. Yes. Now, did you get thrown into that? Are you a sports fan? How did it become, hey, Jamie Hay, sports editor? Um, sports are my life. Okay. <laughs> I love sports. I've never played them, but I've always loved them. I've watched them my entire life. Um, I grew up in a big football family. Um, both my parents love watching NFL every single week. Um, so that's just what I've done all my life. Watch sports all the time. So when I knew that I wanted to be, when I thought about my career, I knew I wanted to do sports. And I can't play them, so I write about them. Well, hey, I know the feeling there. I, uh, <laughs> I talk about them because I can't play them. All right, sports center, you, you've obviously got a passion for sports. How do you convert that into covering sports? Well, um, just my passion just comes through when I when I cover the sports. As of right now, as editor, I don't get to cover a lot of the sports. Um, I give it to other people um, to cover. Mm -hmm. um, I'm just doing the editing right now. But um, okay. when I get to cover sports, it's just incredible. I, there's such a rush when I, after an interview or something, just talking to someone, having to run after someone and just like, you know, just make them talk to me. It's, it's, it's really it's incredible. It's just such a rush and I, I'm very passionate about it. Well, that's good. Now talk about covering sports or being the sports setter for Humboldt State. Now Humboldt's got a kind of a stereotype of a super liberal campus. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people would assume they don't care about sports yet. When I go to basketball games, I go to football games, I see a ton of students here cheering on their jacks. Um, I've noticed that. Um, I noticed when I came here that sports weren't, weren't something that was very important to this school, which made me really sad. I noticed a lot of people really didn't care besides the athletes. Um, I'm hoping to change that. Um, I'm hoping to make people more interested in it. Um, I, basketball games and softball games and football games, there's a ton of fans there. And I look and I said, where are you on campus? You know, I don't see these kind of people when I'm walking around. But they're, they're here. They're just hidden. And um, I'm trying to bring them out and, you know, show the school that sports are important. You know, our athletes are out here doing it all the time and they're working really hard and we need to give them more respect. Now, of course, when I talk to people in the community, they understand that relationship. Mm -hmm. But real quick, what do you think the relationship is between uh, the students and the athletes in that mix? Not necessarily how they get along, but what the students feel about sports. Um, I feel that if you're not into the sports, then it's just like like it's clicks almost, just almost kind of like high school where it's you have the jocks and you have the other people. I mean, if you're into sports, you kind of talk to your fellow teammates and you talk to other people about sports. Then does it kind of really branch outside of that? Well, you'll have to work on that, Jamie. Yes, thank definitely. you so much for stopping by. Thank Pick up the me. lumberjack. Was it come out every Wednesday? Every Wednesday. Yep. See Jamie's work. Hey, number another uh, great night of uh, Humboldt State tonight on our special time this week. So I want to thank the folks down at Eureka Television for that. Hey, I want to thank all the sponsors: Miller Farms, Del Rica Distributing. Miller Lite, Bear River Casino, Coast Central Credit Union, because belonging never felt better, and Schaefer's Ace Hardware. Hey, we'll do it again next week. I'm JB Mathers. It's been another fantastic show. You can always email us at jb at jbmathers.com on Humboldt State Tonight.